picks of the week. All right, my pick of the week is Steve Jobs' The Lost Interview. Have you guys seen this yet? No. So this is uh, Robert X. Cringely. Have you ever, he made the documentary, uh, or he wrote the book Accidental Empires, which is a good book, good read from 1992, uh, updated and everything since then in some paperback. Uh, but then they, they made something that I saw as a kid, which was the Triumph of the Nerds documentary on PBS. It was like a big three-hour, three-part series. I remember that. Uh, yeah, so in that documentary, it had some very interesting interview clips of Steve Jobs. He conducted one, because Cringely actually knew Steve Jobs uh, earlier in life. And so they, they, he got an especially candid interview with him that actually lasted over an hour. But between making the documentary portions, uh, the tape, the, the master tape was lost. So what you see in Triumph for the Nerds documentary is all that survived from that interview. There's actually an hour's worth. And so even though they did use some of the best clips in that documentary, there's still a lot to enjoy here, a lot of interesting things to see if you're a, if you're a fan or interested at all in Steve Jobs. Uh, he, he talks very candidly. And again, this is before he returned to Apple. This is the interview with him in 1995. Uh, and it's available now as a rental uh, on iTunes for $3.99, four bucks. It's also been making its way around to independent movie theaters as a digital projection. Uh, that's what it's been doing for the last, I don't know, six, seven months, and now it's finally available for rental. Uh, and it's pretty interesting. Um, so again, he, he he talks about how despondent he was when he left Apple. He talks about, or he, he avoids talking about Next. He's like, you don't want to, you really don't want to hear about that. Like you all, all but says like, I'm done with Next. I'm so yeah. over Next. Uh, so there's some interesting stuff here. It's it's um, uh, not, not a bad way to spend an hour if you're at all interested in Steve Jobs. So it's called Steve Jobs, The Lost Interview. Just search for that in the iTunes store. I think if you go to uh, magpictures.com, uh, they have it on there also.